Hey guys, before we get into today's video, I just want to say a huge thanks for NDS Let's Plays and I will definitely play with you sometime and I did get a new subscriber so whoever you are, if it is you or if it's someone else, thank you so much, I really do appreciate it. Hey guys, words up, today we're playing some ranked tower control on Starfish main stage and I'm using the Mean Beam itself, the Heavy Splat Lane with the Sprinker and the Stingray Special. So let's go ahead and jump in this and I just stammered a lot. But yeah, it should be a good game. I don't know too much about this map, but yeah, wish me luck. I really like the uh, Heavy Splat Lane, it's quite good on tower defense and all. It's good if you're not on the tower, but just absolutely controlling the area with it. It's not a big flanking weapon or anything, you can't react fast, but it's got some range on it. So if you can stay a bit further back than most other people, you'll be in a good spot. Sorry, I was focusing there, and that guy pushed me hard. I'm gonna. Oh! Oh, my teammate nearly saved me. But they do have control of it at first, but that's not too bad. It is a bit unfortunate, but we should be able to get it back. So let's go ahead and jump in this. I do not like the Stingray special though. I'm not very good with it. So maybe I should use a different bow. This one's jumping this. I'm going to try and spray them down as well when they land. Oh, can I get a triple? Oh, I've got a triple. Can I get the quad? I've got to tap my gun. No! Oh, oh nearly. But hopefully our team should be able to get that now. Because I did kill three of them. So we'll see. Hopefully I'll be a bit disappointed. And it looks like they did kind of to main, maintain control of it. So that is a bit unfortunate here, so we'll see if we can help our team out, see what we can do. No, it's just a homing bomb. I'll, I'll uh, pop up here and see if we can get around this side. We do have control of the tower now, and this guy's going to get annihilated by three of us. Yeah, I didn't even get a shot on him, he died that far. Because our teammate is on the tower, I'm going to try to go mid-map because it, they will be coming this way. Cover it in some ink. But can make sure my weapon is still full of charge. I do have my special now as well, which is always nice. Let's see if we can blast this guy. Oh! Oh! Oh, that's close. Yeah, I'm so bad with the stingray, so if you've got any tips, please let me know. I can know you can kind of let go of the trigger and then re aim it, but I am just not good with the stingray at all. Uh, I'm going to chuck a sprinkler on the tower just to keep everyone off it. Let's see if we can get this guy. Beautiful, and is now this guy who has this special available to them, so I do want to kill them. Are they just used it? Can I pick up the kill there? I'll save my teammate. Yes, we can. And now we need to push. My sprinkler is on the tower, but I'm going to get on it and start pushing. So this, if I can get it just to this checkpoint on the left, we will be doing great. They do have the tower at the moment, though. I had to back off there because I don't have a close range gun. I did get some Oh, I nearly got two people with it. My teammate might be able to save him, the one with the umbrella, and it looks like maybe not. I'm going to go to my teammate on the left, who should just be about out of danger, hopefully. Yeah, beautiful. That's a good spot, because it gets us right back into the fire. But we're not too close, we get caught. That's what you always want to look out for. You want to be close to the fire, but not directly in it, or you will die straight away. And this is why the, uh, the light machines are good. I just picked up three then. It's got such a beast range. It can outrange every gun apart from a sniper, pretty much. Can I get this guy? I'm going to have to tap him up though. Oh no. Oh, we killed each other. Always a risk. That's it, shortfall. If you get caught out, you get flanked. Someone gets close to you. It is hard to kill them. I am going to look. I'm going to go to the left again because I don't think this guy. Sorry, the left hand guy is on the right. Because I don't think this will be contested and it's not. We do have 68 points remaining though, so we do have a fair bit to make up. But I did manage to save my teammate there. And if I can kill this guy on top of it, it would be amazing. Oh, again. Oh, and another triple kill. The triple kills. Do not stop, and now so that my teammate can move on. Because there's two people already on it, again, you do not want to be on it if there's two people on it, because it's just more people for them to kill. If I can just clip people through this wall... Oh! oh. Right, I need to get out of here now. Oh, oh, there's no way I could fight that. So all my teammates in there, but it's a bit scary of position as they all are fighting, so I'm going to stay at spawn, because if they do get wiped, you need someone to cover. Oh, and we get it! Beautiful! That was actually really nice. Uh, we was on the back foot at the start, but we did manage to take it back, and even score. So that's how you can come back, a nice little comeback. Again, I didn't have much tower control time, but I did put a lot of pressure on the team with those triple kills. Let's have a look. I uh, did get 15 kills and free with the Stingray, which is amazing for me. 
guys, we're back on Tower Control again with the same gear, but we're on a different map this time. We are playing on Snapper Canal, so let's go ahead and jump in and do this. So, again, I'm going to try and stay back, zone the objective, so I'm going to chuck a sprinkler this side. I know they can shoot it down, but as long as they're focusing the sprinkler, they're not focusing my team on me. And if not, then it just slows them down a bit. And our team do have it, so I'm going to push left with them for now, keep it covered. I can see there's someone dropping here, so I'm just going to light it up. And we do get a nice double because of that, which is beautiful. As long as one of you is on the objective, it's great. You don't need more than one because it's just grenade bait. And I can see my teammate is on it, so I am going to hop off it here. Only because it is pure grenade bait. I'm going to see if I can get a cheeky kill on this guy with my splatter. I am so bad with the stingray. Help me, please. In this cover... Oh, God. I, I whiffed that, but I'm not very good with it. I fully admit that. I did get a nice kill there. And they're only on 20 points left already. So this is off to a fantastic start. So let's see if we can push this all the way to the finish line. Ah, beautiful. So because this was so quick, I will treat you to a third game today, just because that was super fast. Hey guys, this should hopefully be the third game of the day. Ah, I am using the exact same setup and same map as last time, so let's go ahead and jump in and do this. Our team was really strong last time, so let's hope they're as good this time. But I'm up for a challenge as well. So I'm going to stay, stay to the edge, get one kill there. Oh, he's, he's coming too close to me. I can't deal with people close range, so I'm just going to back off. There we are. Back off, shoot him up a lot. And I didn't see the guy on the, because I'm an idiot until it was too late. But that wasn't too bad. Managed to get a double at the start, but I think they did clear up most of our team as well. They are on our checkpoint, and one of them does have... Ooh. I keep, oh, God. Oh, God. I just ran straight into him. I was blind. He did do really well there, but yeah, that was my fault as well. Absolute idiot. So it looks like this opposite's happening towards this time. So I'm going to stay up here and kill the guys on the point first. There we are. There's two of them. My teammate did manage to get up. There's the blaster guy. Teammate's got them. Oh, God, I'm getting carried. And that guy using his ult now is really good for us because all his team's dead. So they probably can't capitalize off it. But he absolutely annihilated me with the blaster. Now, I need to step this up. I'm losing this for my teammate, yeah. And we go to the right where the tower is. Beautiful. I played it a bit risky there because I thought there might be a couple of them. So I did take a little chance. But I wanted to get this uh, get this moving. And we do pick him up. Beautiful. And let's grab this guy. Perfect. Jump back on because it stopped moving. Spray these down for a cheeky double. Everything's going well. I can see he's dropping down off there. So if I can shoot where it lands. Which I can't because I'm terrible. I'm going to hop off now because I have my special, so I don't want to waste my special by getting focused down. But if someone's going to jump on it, I will kill it. Yo. Nope. There we are. I managed to get one. My teammate got the other. I get this guy on the right. It'll play beautiful. I'm going to spray it through this wall here where they are dropping. Hopefully, I can find someone. Oh, there's someone there. I'm so bad with this gun. I'm sorry. I am drawing fire though if I get this splatter guy, beautiful, but I need to get back to the point and help my team. It's all good getting kills, but if you're nowhere near the point or not doing anything, then what's the point? Because one of my team's on it, I'm going to follow my own advice and get off it. Grab one there. Oh, the dually guy. Can I grab him? Beautiful, we do get him. And my teammate did push it up a lot before he died. I do have the... I do have the stinger, so I'm just going to hose down the objective. And I get a double with it. Jesus Christ, I'm so happy. Oh, sorry for, sorry for that. Uh, this guy's going to land on me and kill me. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, no way. I got lucky. It looked like his controller stopped because he stood still for a second. I'll, I'll take it. I don't care. I'll take it. And it is resetting, so I need to jump on it. And I do get it. I think I have, I have close range against an ink brush. Oh. A trade is absolutely perfect from a from a long range gun with next to an ink brush. I will take that any day of the week. I am going to safely fly there because it looks like both my team might be in combat and I don't want none of that. So we are now pushed back and we are now winning this game, which is good because we did come from a down downwards position. See if we can grab that guy and this guy. Look at the range of it. If I camp on this side here, I should be able to kill all of them. But I do want to push it to the spawn. I do want to help out still. So I'm going to hop on it now just to get it moving again. Get him while he's not looking. This guy's going to come from up here. Oh, I was ready for you. Oh, I think they fell in the water. Uh, they're pushing it back. Can I kill him? Yep. And hop back on it. Oh, I did die, but 
keeping it there. If we can keep it there for the last one minute, 20 seconds, I'll be over the moon. So I'm going to jump on my team here. Oh, no. This one now, because he's the furthest away. So hopefully I'll be okay. But I can see there's a guy to my right here. Right ah, and that's the problem. So that's why you don't super jump unless you're sure that no one's in danger. Because now I've just wasted extra time and they've got to push it a lot further. So if I, if I listen to my own advice, guys, it might, it might help. But if I jump up here to get the high ground, since I do have the long range weapon, pick the one on the actual objective off. I'm just going to keep my charge weapon on it, waiting for them to jump on it. There we are. Grab him and all. And now, now that the coast is clear, my team do have it. Hop up on the right side. Oh, I want to try and cut them off. Can I uh, do it? I'm pre-charged. There we are, there's one. And there's two. Beautiful. Absolute killing frenzy, this game. See, this gun's good. You've just got to know how to use it. But I do admit, I do need a different version of it on next time. Because the uh, sprinkler, unless you get it right on the tower, it's not the best in this mode. And you can still shoot it off the tower. So, yeah. The actual gun itself, great. I'm going to die here. But there's only six seconds left. The actual gun itself, amazing. Or oh, a sub and special. In my eyes, leave a lot to be desired. But that is game, guys. And that's going to be the third game of the day. So I hope you did enjoy. Thank you for watching. Uh, thanks for everything. I hope you have a great day. Let's have a look at the stats just before I go. I think I did get a few kills there. I'll take 32 kills. That is a lot of kills. So, yeah, thank you for watching. And we are A-minus now. Perfect. Have a nice day. Cheers. Bye.